friends good morning today we will read mathematics standard of 4 chapter 1 that is revision you see the question question number 1 write the number name write the number name the number is 3405 okay you see the number is 3405 In thousands place is three. That means three thousand. Okay. In hundreds plus it is four. That means four hundred. In tens plus zero and ones plus five. So the number is three thousand four hundred five. Okay. We will write three thousand three. Three thousand four hundred five. Okay, like that. You see the next number eight zero zero seven. That means eight thousand and seven. Likewise, all the problems you do the rest problems. Okay, now. We will do the next question. You see, the question is, what is the question? You read the question. Write the numerals. Write the. Write the numerals. What is the numeral? What is the question given? You see, first question. Seven thousand two hundred eighty-five. Seven thousand two hundred eighty-five. Okay. You see the question is seven thousand two hundred eighty-five. Seven thousand two hundred eighty-five. Okay. Then in thousands plus seven thousands. That means we will write in thousands plus seven. How many hundreds? Two hundreds. In hundreds plus we will write two. Then eighty-five. Eighty-five means eight ten five one. So the numeral was seven two five eight five. Seven two eight. Next question is encircle the greatest number. Encircle the greatest number. The first question is eight five three seven eight thousand. Five hundred thirty-seven. Okay. Next number is eight five three nine. Eight five three nine. Eight thousand five hundred thirty-nine. Next number is eight three five seven. Eight three five seven. Eight thousand three hundred and fifty-seven. Next eight seven three five. Eight seven. Three five eight seven eight thousand seven hundred thirty five. Last number is eight nine three five. Eight thousand nine hundred thirty five. To add to calculate the largest number, greatest number, first we examine the thousands place. Eight here all the numbers have eight. In the thousands plus, so we see the hundreds plus number. In hundreds plus, it is five. 
here also 5, here 3, here 7, here 9. So, which is the largest number out of 5, 5, 3, 7, 9? 9 is the largest number. So, this number is also greatest number in between these 5 numbers. Which is the largest number? 8, 9, 3, 5. Okay. You see, all rest questions you have to do tomorrow, you will do these rest questions. Okay. Next, we will do the next question that is number D. Encircle the smallest number. Encircle the smallest number. What are the numbers sir? You see first number is 3, 6, 8, 5. 3, 6, 8, 5. The next number is 3, 6, 5, 8. Next is 3, 5, 6, 8. Next number is 3, 5, 8, 6. And the last number is 3865. Here there are 5 numbers. First number, thousands plus, here 3, here also 3. All the numbers have 3 in their thousands plus. Then I turn in the hundreds plus, here 6. In second number 6, here 5, here 5, here 8. So, out of these five numbers, these numbers are smaller. Which number? 3500, here also 3500. Out of these two numbers, we examine the hundreds plus number. Here, hundreds plus, tens plus, sorry. Here, in tens plus six, here in tens plus eight. So, this is the smallest number out of these five numbers. Okay, 3568 is the smallest number out of these five numbers. Tomorrow we we'll have to do all the rest numbers. Okay. The question is write in the expanded form. The number is given, the numeral is 4636. We will write in the expanded form. You see, here in thousands plus 4, that means there is 4,000. In hundreds plus 6, means 600. In tens plus 3, that is 30. And 1 plus 6. So, we will write 4,600, 3, 10 equal to 30 and 6. So, the, in expanded form, the number 4636 is 4000 plus 600 plus 30 plus 6. Okay. Next, you do all rest problems. Okay. You see, you see the question, the next question is, right? In the short form, write in the short form. In the question is given 7000 plus 500 plus 30 plus 5. So, in thousands plus, that is 7, in hundreds plus 5, in tens plus 3, and ones plus 5. So, the number is 7535. 7535. In the short form, the given number is 7535. Did you understand? Okay. You do all rest problems. Okay. You see, the next question is arrange in ascending order. Arrange in ascending order. The numbers are given 2639. Next, 2600, 
You see the underlined number is 9. So it is in the thousands place. So the place value is 9000. You see like it you do all rest problems. Okay. You see understood. You see the next question fill in the boxes according to the pattern. Fill in the boxes according to the pattern. Here the pattern, the two numbers are given. According to these two numbers, we fill up the rest three boxes. Which numbers are there? You see here 430 and here 440. The difference of these two numbers is 10. So, what number we have to write in this box? It must be, there must be the difference 10. So, the number is 450. What is the number difference 10 between 2 450? The number is 460. And the next number is, what is the number? You see, you tell, what is the number? That is 470. So, the answer is 450. 460 and 470. You see the next problem here the number is 735, here the number is 740. What is the difference in between these two numbers? 5. So in between these two numbers also the difference must be 5. That is the number 745. In between these two numbers also difference must be 5. So the number is 750 and the last is 755. Did you understood? You see, like this, you do all rest problems. Okay? You see, you see, the next question, add the following. Add the following. See the question? The number is 5831 and 3146. You see in thousands place in first number 5 and in the second number 3 in hundreds place first number 8 and second number 1 in thousands, tens place 3 and 4 we have to first add from 1's place 1 plus 6 1 plus 6 equal to 7 1 plus 6 equal to 7 then add the tens plus number 3 plus 4, also 7. You see, hundreds plus here is 8 and here is 1. 8 plus 1 equal to 9. And thousands plus 5, here 3, 5 plus 3 equal to 8. Okay, so the answer is 8977. When we add these two numbers, we will get the answer 8977. You see another question. Here in 1 plus 5 and the next number 9, when we will add 9 plus 5 is 14. 9 plus 5 equal to 14. So we will put 4 in 1 plus and we will carry the 1 to the tens place. Okay. You see how it is. The sum of 9 plus 5 is 14. We will write 4 in 1's place. And take carry the 1 to the tens place. Then add 1 plus 0 plus 4. So the answer is 4 plus 1 equal to 5. Then the hundreds plus the numbers are 1 and 7. 1 plus 7 equal to 1 plus 7 equal to 8. Then in thousands plus only single number that is 7. So the answer is 7854. Okay. You do all rest problems. Okay. See you. The next question. Subtract. The question is. 9, 3, 6, 4, 
from 9364 we have to subtract 7817 okay you see first we have to subtract from ones plus here is 4 from 4 we have to subtract 7 we can't so we have to borrow 110 from 6 when 110 will come it will 4 plus 110 that is 14 from 14 we have to subtract 7 so the answer is 7 next you see here 5 now 5 in the tens plus from 5 we have to subtract 1 5 minus 1 equal to 4 next in hundreds plus the number is 3 we have to subtract 8 so we can't we borrow 1000 from 9000 and it will be 1000 that is 10 this one is 3 that is 1300 from 1300 we have to subtract 8 13 minus 13 minus 8 equal to 5 then here the rest thousand number is 8 8 minus 7 equal to 1 so the answer is 1547 like this you do all rest problems Okay, you see the next question, the next question is multiplying, we multiply, the question is 1634 multiplied by 2, we have to multiply 1634 by 2, so when we multiply this number is known as multiply. We multiply the number by this number the, that is known as multiply. We have to multiply 1634 by 2. You see, first we multiply by 2 to one's plus number that is 4, 4 to 8. We will write in ones plus. Then multiply two by the tens number that is three. Three to the six. We will write in the tens plus three to the six. Then multiply by hundred plus number that is six. Six to the twelve. We will write two in the hundreds plus and we will take this one to thousands plus then multiply two by thousands plus number one to one the two plus one that is three you see again i am telling two four the eight two three the six two six the twelve we will write two and take the one to the thousands plus then two one the two plus one three so the answer is 3268. You see, then we will multiply two digit number. You see the question. This is the question number 5. Okay. We will multiply 5321 by 13. So 13 is the multiply. This is two digit number. If we will multiply by two digit number. First multiply by we don't know 13 table. So we multiply the number first ones plus number that is 3. 3 ones are 3. 3 2 the 6. 3 3 the 9. 3 5 the 15. First we multiply by ones plus number then we multiply by tens plus number we multiply the number by one here when we multiply by 
one with the tens place number. So we have to write that number below the tens place number. That is one one ja one. Here we have to not write anything because this is the tens place number. When we multiply it by tens place number, the answer should be tens number. One one ja one. Then one two ja two. One three ja three. One five ja five. After multiplying, we add these numbers. Three. Six one ja six plus one. Seven. Nine plus two. Eleven. We take one here. One plus five. One plus five six six plus three nine here five plus one six. So the answer is sixty nine thousand one hundred seventy three. This is the answer. Okay. You see the next question. Divide. We divide this number by. Five. Here, the number by which we divide that is known as divisor, and to whom we divide that is dividend. You see, here the divisor is five. When we divide, we first take the first number. This is seven. Seven is divisible by five. We can divide seven by five. That is five one ja five. Then we subtract five from seven. The remainder is the rest is two. Then bring the second number to down. Bring down the second number. So the number is twenty two. Then. We will divide twenty-two by five. We have to count the five. Five one is five. Five two is ten. Five three is fifteen. Five four is twenty. Five five is twenty-five, which is greater than twenty-two. So we take five four is five four is twenty. So the rest is we subtract twenty-two. Twenty from twenty-two, the rest is two. Then bring down the next number that is three. So the number is twenty-three. We divide twenty-three by five. Now five table. Five one is five. Five two is ten. Five three is fifteen. Five four is twenty. Five five is twenty-five, which is greater than thirty-three. So we will take four. Five four is twenty. Subtract twenty from twenty-three. The remainder is the rest is three, and bring down the next number five. So the number is thirty-five. We will divide thirty-five by five in the five table. Five seven is thirty-five. Okay. So the rest is zero. So the answer is one thousand four hundred. Forty-seven. When we will divide seven thousand two hundred thirty-five by five, the answer is one thousand four hundred forty-seven. Okay. Like that, I am also doing the next question. Now this is question number three. Here we will divide eight thousand two hundred sixty-four by six. Now we will take another question. Suppose one eight nine zero, one eight nine zero. We will divide by nine. This is question number eight. Here we will divide. 
plus 150 equal to 4150 4150 gram 4 kilogram 150 gram equal to 4150 gram the next 8 kilometer 350 meter you see 1 kilometer equal to 1000 meter 1 kilometer equal to 1000 meter so 8 kilometer equal to 8000 8 into 1000 equal to 8000 meter plus 350 meter 350 equal to 8350 8350 meter that is 8 kilometer 350 meter equal to 8350 meter next 947 centimeter 947 centimeter when we will make it meter we have to divide by 100 947 divided by 100 that means the decimal is it will come to refer to numbers that is 9.47 this is the meter, this is centimeter. That means 947 centimeter equal to 9 meter 47 centimeter. Okay. Then the next question 5970 gram. 5970 gram. 5900. 70 gram when we will do kilogram to gram we have to divide by 1000 so the answer is the decimal will come between 5 and 9 before 3 numbers because there are 3 zeros 5.970 so Five thousand nine hundred seventy gram equal to five kilogram nine seventy gram. Five kilogram nine seventy gram. Okay. Next five thousand seven hundred twenty nine milliliter. Five thousand seven hundred twenty. 9,729 milliliter when we will make milliliter to liter we have to divide by 1000 1 milliliter equal to 1 by 1000 liter so divide by 1000 so the answer is 5.729 because there are 3 zeros the decimal will come before 3 numbers that is 5.729 So 5729 milliliter equal to 5 liter and 729 